musicians, congratulations on making it to the last week of your ukulele program. I just wanted to say thank you for joining me on this musical journey and I hope that you all had a lot of fun. For this week, we are going to continue switching between our C chord and G chord. Then we are going to learn a new song called Mary Had a Little Lamb. Before we get started, make sure that your ukulele is in tune. Let's review our C chord. Take your third finger and place it on the orange star, just like this. For this exercise, we are going to strum downward on beat one. It will look like this. One, two, ready, play. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. It is your turn to try. Place your third finger on the orange star and be ready to play. One, two, ready, play. One, two, three, four. 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 That was fantastic playing. Good job. For this chord, we are going to use three fingers. Our first finger will go on the C string on the second fret, right next to your blue star. Your second finger is going to go also on the second fret, but on the A string, just right above the orange star. Your third finger is going to go right next to the orange star, but on the E string on the third fret. It's going to sound like this. I know it may feel a little bit weird to stretch your fingers in this way, but try to get as close to the frets as you can. For this exercise, we are going to strum downward on beat one. It will look like this. One, two, ready, play. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Four, one, two, three, four. Now it is your turn to play. Place your fingers on the G chord and be ready. One, two, ready, play. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Great job playing your G chord! If you need more practice, go ahead and try the exercise again. We are going to start with our C chord. Place your third finger on the orange star and play the chord with me. Now we are going to switch to the G chord. Place your second finger on the A string on the second fret, just above your third finger. Then place your first finger on the C string, on the second fret also, right next to your blue star. Finally, lift your third finger and move it one string over to the E string. This is the G chord. Play the chord with me. Good job! Let's switch back to our C chord. Lift up your first finger, lift up your second finger, and move your third finger back to the orange star. Play the chord with me. One more time, let's go back to our G chord. Place your second finger on the A string on the second fret, just above your third finger. Then place your first finger on the C string on the second fret also, right next to the blue star. Finally, lift your third finger and move it one string over to the E string. This is the G chord. Play the chord with me. Finally, we are going to go back to our C chord. So lift your first finger, lift your second finger, then move your third finger back to the orange star 
and play the chord with me. Good job switching between your chords. It may take some time to get used to going back and forth, so be patient with yourself and keep on trying. You will get it in no time. Once you have mastered switching back and forth, try playing the strumming exercise with me. For this exercise, we are going to switch between the chords before beat one. It will look like this. One, two, ready, play. C chord, two, three, four. G chord, two, three, four. C chord, two, three, four. G chord, two, three, four. C chord, two, three, four. It is your turn to try. Place your third finger on the orange star and be ready to play. One, two, ready, play. C chord, two, three, four. G chord, two, three, four. C chord, two, three, four. G chord, two, three, four. C chord, two, three, four. G chord, two, three, four. C chord, two, three, four. G chord, two, three, four. C chord, two, three, four. That was amazing. Good job playing along. It's time to learn our new song called Mary Had a Little Lamb. For this song, we are going to be switching between the C chord and the G chord. The C chord will be represented by the orange words, and the G chord will be represented by the purple words. For this song, we are going to start with our C chord. So place your third finger on the orange star and be ready to play. One, two, ready, play. Mary had a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Mary had a little lamb, his face was white as snow. Everywhere that Mary went, Mary went, Mary went. Everywhere that Mary went, the lamb was sure to go. Great job playing along! Thanks again for joining me this week. I hope you all had a lot of fun. And I hope to see you all again sometime soon. Happy holidays!